Speakers at the public forum organized by Media Journal in partnership with Vodafone Healthline on the global scourge of coronavirus have called for intensified public education. Here's the reason why. They also want constant communication on preparation put in place should there be an outbreak. Head of the virology department at the Noguchi Memorial Institute discounted claims that Africans, and for that matter, Ghanaians, are immune to the virus. The thing that worries me is that because you don't get to talk to scientists like me often, there's a lot of misrepresentation on social media. You find stories about uh, 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 chickens being infected with, with coronavirus. You find stories about Africans being immune, genetic, genetically immune uh, to the novel coronavirus. Uh, please, one person is not a steady. One person, one Cameroonian is not a steady. If you take the population of Africans and you compare it to one person, you need to really do a, a, a proper study before you say that we are immune to, 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 to this virus. There were calls for the strengthening of the public health system. Ghana, we are like one population. So you need to make sure that you look at the population as a whole. If one person, if you say, oh, uh, in the local and we have like the OFIAS and that is what like that kind of like maybe I get it and then you don't have it and then you say oh, let's leave this man alone uh, because this is a whole matter by the time you know then it's going to come uh, to you so uh, that is what uh, like at the, uh, the national level that's what government can do. The theme for the forum was imagine infectious diseases and their effects on public health management in Ghana.